Okay, everybody, today's video we're going to be fixing a GVC or GCV 200 Honda lawnmower. Need some carburetor work. This thing's pretty much brand new, but sometimes you just let the fuel sit and it hurts the little carburetor. Not a lot you can do. We're going to get right into this by popping off this. See, look at that brand new air filter. Beautiful. We need some 10 millimeters here, and it looks like. On these newer models, I don't have to remove a third 10 millimeter bolt. So let me get the 10 millimeter out and we'll get right into it. People always ask me, where the heck do you find grass in Arizona? Well, if you have enough money to buy a whole basketball court and tennis court, you have enough for a beautiful lawn. Okay, 10 millimeter nuts. Oh my goodness gracious, guys, I think, I think Honda did it right this time. Oh my gosh, they did. They put studs in there. Oh my goodness, that is the best. <clears throat> Honda did it right this time. I don't have to play three arm shuffle with this thing. So we take off the fuel line. <clears throat> and the fuel's off now, so that's good. See, this is how Honda should have done all their machines, like this. Instead of, you know, where you have to hold it and then you do that thing where you put the two bolts in. That is god awful. This is the right way. This is the right way. So we got the carburetor here. I'm just going to give it a quick deep clean off camera. We're going to check this fuel real quick, see what it looks like. Looking good, brand new, clear as heck. So let me just give this thing a clean. All you need is some brushes and some cleaner and we'll throw this thing back on and see what happens okay so the main problem with this was actually down here where the needle goes that was clogged so it wasn't the jet or anything it was just down here so i just took my wire brushes cleaned real good in there sprayed out the whole carburetor anyways and now we can put it back together and get it back on the lawnmower and see what happens okay so now that we got this all done, we can put it back on. <clears throat> we'll just hit up the throttle cable. We'll put the throttle spring back in. Now from there, we'll put it back on right there. Put the fuel line back on. <clears throat> put the clamp back on. Oh, I'm so glad Honda did this. I can't tell you how much I, I keep saying it now. Makes it a lot better, guys. A lot better. Now we'll put the air filter cover back on. We still have to line up the hose up in there. That's not a big deal. Just like that. Now we can put the two tins back on. And it should be able to we'll always turn on the gas, make sure there's no leaks. Always do that. We'll leave the air filter cover off for now. And now we'll see if she starts. One last test to make sure this thing starts up.
Things working real good now. Everything's working good. I look at from previous mowing. So now he can mow around his basketball court and his backyard and everything else. So while editing, I totally forgot that I didn't record an outro while I was there. <clears throat> so here it is, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. I hope you guys got all your outdoor equipment and everything you need ready for this mowing season. It's going to be great. 2022 is going to be a great year. So make sure you check them carburetors before you go out to the customer's place or before you go out to your own yard. You check them weed eaters. You make sure they fire up before you put fresh gas in it. Because the number one thing I always hear customers say was, you know what? I don't understand why that start. I put fresh gas in it. Well, listen, you didn't put fresh gas in that carburetor because it was plumb clogged and couldn't get no fresh gas. But without further ado, ladies and gentlemen, we have got this mower ready for this year, this 2022 mowing season. This guy will be able to mow his grass around his basketball court, around his tennis court, around his backyard pool. If you have money, you have grass. I love this guy. This guy was great. I also have a video coming up later that is for a power rake, which you don't ever see on YouTube. And anyways, if this wasn't your mower, check out this playlist right here. That's all lawn mower repairs, baby. And right under that, well, right now, I don't know what that is, but that's going to be the power rake video when it comes out next week. So you guys want to see that, hit that subscribe button. Click that bell so you guys can see that video when it does come out. Love y'all. My name's Andrew. Thank you guys for spending some time here on my channel.